What up guys, coming at you guys with another video here to talk about uh, Teofimo Lopez and he did an interview with the fans about the Q&A and you guys know that he's supposed to face Lomachenko probably one of his last fights at 135 after that he really does want to make a move up to 140 and Ramirez was supposed to fight Postal but you know that got postponed and then top rank signed uh, Josh Taylor he had a great fight with uh, Regis. And we all know that pretty much that's the money fight at 140 right now. I mean, Ramirez has two belts. Taylor has two belts. So that would be a great unification fight. And Lopez mentioned he he wants to move up to 140. He's going to be very interested in that fight. Um, to see, you know, pretty much scout with competition. Which he should be because, you know, he's going to move up and wait. And those are the top guys. And just them being in the top rank stable makes it so much easier uh to get matches and fights um so i can't personally myself i can't wait for that fight either that's a great fight josh taylor ramirez i would have to slightly favor ramirez just because of uh he doesn't seem to get tired uh he punches a lot throws combinations and he has a hell of a resume well not well it's not well you guys get what i'm saying but Lopez himself, he would do good at 142. I mean, we don't really know if he's struggling to make 135 or not. But it must be so because he's just really trying to get that Loma fight and then moving up. Which is respectful. You know, Lomachenko is a great fighter. You know, if he could get Lomachenko's name on his resume and be unified, not undisputed yet. That, you know, that would work in his favor. But let me know down in the comment section if you guys think Teofimo uh, is ready for the big hitters at 140. Or should he stay at 145? Alright guys.